Hi, this video shows you how to edit the audio envelope in AVVS Video Editor. Okay, we're going to use three files, a demonstration video clip and a couple of audio uh, tracks. A soundtrack and an extra track. It doesn't really matter what these are, they're just for demonstration purposes. Okay, now we'll go down to the timeline. Okay, here's the timeline. We're going to drag down the first video clip. Here it comes. Okay, now we're going to drag down the first audio track. It doesn't really matter what this is. You can mix and you can add extra tracks. Here it comes. It's the first track. Now, what we have to do now is add another track. Now, we could put it in there, but I'll show you how to add an extra track. You click there on the context menu, add line. And there it is. So we'll pull down the next one. Okay, so we have two soundtracks now. We'll just zoom in so it will become clear exactly what I'm doing here. Now what, what we want to do is to have an introductory piece of music or whatever, the soundtrack, and then it fades out into the second. So we move the timeline to a certain point and then we start splitting the soundtracks. We'll split both of these. The reason we're doing that is so we can delete the first section of the main soundtrack because we don't actually want that. Okay, now what we'll do here is we'll just bring the cursor over there and we'll cut off the rest of that. We don't actually want the rest. So we now have, once it's gone, we now have an overlapping section. Now, what I do first is select the end point. To do that, you move your mouse over to it until you get the cursor, and you left click and drag that point down to the bottom. Here we go, dragging it down to the bottom. Now that will fade the volume out. Bottom is, is softer and top is um, louder. We'll go up to the top and we'll add a point on that audio envelope. We get the selection and we double click. Once we double click, you can see pulling away there's a point just there and we can play around with that point. But at the moment we'll go to the end point and we'll drag that down. So in this case, what's happening is the volume is going from nothing to standard. And that's a simple fade. Now, uh, we can do more of the soundtrack of course. We can add more points along that. So here we are, we get the selection cursor and double click, and there's another point. We get the selection cursor and double click, and there's another point. And we can move that around, we can play around with the volume any way we want, and we can shape it any way we want. Now you'll notice we can also adjust the main line, and you'll notice that it drags the point with it, but it doesn't affect the other parts of the envelope which those points have anchored. Now if you're unhappy with this, I mean you may have made a mistake, you can't actually delete individual ones. What you have to do is get the context menu up and there it is, reset envelope. Select that and it's flat again and it's standard. We don't actually want that so we'll select double click, there's a point and we'll drag that down. So we now have fade out of the second soundtrack and fade in of the top. Isn't that cool?